many stories that have been made up about me. I've heard I've dated a father and son before. You know, I've set up with him. We've talked for hours. I just can't find nothing wrong with him. I Hi there. Welcome to Relax Brew. Following Lori Harvey, Dam, and Idris's recent split, the dominant narrative has unexpectedly changed, contradicting the widely accepted belief that Lori was the one who made the decision, despite new rumors suggesting that Damson may have done so. The story is made more intriguing by the accusation that Harvey has long harbored a dislike for Damson. This new revelation has sparked the conjecture that Master Mars' thoughts regarding Damson might have played a crucial part in Lore's relationship breakdown. Let's explore this topic in more detail in today's video, but first, make sure to hit the notify button and subscribe to our channel. As the rumors swirl, Bell calls for more updates and videos such as these that depict Marjorie penetrating herself once more. The matter more complex, by introducing a long-standing aspect of supposed enmity towards Damson, which makes one wonder if Marjorie's influence has extended into her daughter's personal life. Not only did she voice her thoughts, but she also actively influenced Lore's romantic relationships, which is excellent in case you missed the most recent news. Jordan and Lori have formally announced their split, as expected, and the fallout has become a public relations disaster for Lore, as she faces a barrage of criticism despite the fact that most people didn't anticipate Lori and Damon's romance to last. The divorce happened earlier than expected, stoking the flames. The mother of Marjorie Lori has entered the family. Marjorie's dominance is a well-known aspect of Harvey family dynamics. Everyone seems to be under her control, including Steve. While it's understandable that Marjorie is a devoted mother, some view her as being overly controlling. This is evident when Frey takes jabs to Damson and sheds light on possible reasons for the separation. This sentiment resonates with memories of Marjorie's involvement in Lore's previous breakup with Michael B. Jordan, where she was quick to criticize the actor. There are rumors that Marjorie's assertive demeanor may have been a major factor in the breakup of Lore and Michael B. Jordan, with speculation that she may have influenced Steve against the actor. Actor during his relationship with Lori before MBJ and Lori started dating, Steve used to talk really well of MBJ and say things like, this guy is such a good guy. He is one of the nicest guys I met, and we've talked for hours. There's nothing wrong with him that I can see. Despite our lengthy conversations, I've never seen that photo of him before, and I still don't see anything wrong with him. When they became an official couple, the dynamic clearly changed, and Steve Harvey clearly changed as well. He no longer expressed his approval of the relationship and exuded obvious discomfort. There's a picture that perfectly captures this uneasiness that I've never seen before, and to be honest, it says a lot about Steve's discomfort. In addition, there's a memorable incident where Steve almost passed out when asked about his feelings about Michael B. Jordan and Lori getting married, these responses paint a vivid picture of Steve's apparent discomfort. The intricacies of his daughter's romantic involvement are further compounded by his uneasiness and disapproval of their relationship. Harvey was asked if he would accept if Michael proposed to Lori, to which he replied, so far, yeah, no man, yeah, yeah. Lori and Michael have been dating for more than a year. No man. When Lori and Michael Jordan eventually broke up, Marjorie wasted no time in expressing her feelings by posting a conspicuously shady video on her Instagram stories. The internet's enduring belief that Marjorie was a puppeteer in the situation only grew stronger due to her previous actions and the strategic way she navigates situations with a caption that excluded all possibility of interpretation. This action not only confirmed earlier rumors, but also gave Lore's breakup with Michael B. Jordan, a more public and aggressive dimension. The Instagram story states, you sit in there too long and stop smelling. So come out of there. If you sit too long, it will stop smelling. Arrive at SAT in addition, Steve tweeted. Focus on yourself, my GII, which is so absurd to even consider. The public scrutiny increased as Marguerite and Steve continued to actively support their daughter's relationship and the breakup that followed, drawing widespread criticism. The couple's level of involvement was deemed unusual, which resulted in intense backlash. It's interesting to note that Marguerite hasn't changed her propensity to meddle in Lore's personal matters. Recent reports indicate that Marjorie is having difficulty accepting the breakup of the relationship. These new intrusions have only intensified the conversation about the Harvey family's involvement in Lore's love life, with many raising concerns about the lines that should be drawn between parental concern and excessive involvement. In fact, Margaret's current response seems a little strange considering the obvious indications that the relationship was bound to end sooner rather than later. The absence of chemical, the relationship between her and her former boyfriend, was obvious from their first public appearances together. 
The couple only recently acknowledged their split in an exclusive statement provided to The Hollywood, despite the friendly tone of their announcement. The reporter said in the statement that they are at a stage in their lives where their unique paths deserve our complete concentration and dedication. They split ways, remaining friends with nothing but love and respect for each other and the time we shared together. Marjorie's surprising reaction keeps drawing attention from onlookers. To wonder why she is currently involved in her daughter's post-breakup story at such a high level. Her bizarre dating history has seen her associated with Future, Pete Diddy, Justin Combs, Diddy's son, Prince from Love and Hip Hop, and, and a few other men. Unsurprisingly, public relations have been widely fanned by Lore's well-known public persona, her past of high-profile partnerships and failed romances in particular circumstances has been a topic of conversation. Regarding her romantic involvement in the business, rumors abound, some propose a history of turbulent relationships. Furthermore, there's discussion regarding whether Laura's relationship style may, given the recent occurrences and Marjorie's engagement in Laurie's personal issues, have been influenced by their mother. The entwined stories of Laura's mother's influence and her public persona add to the ongoing conversation about their family dynamics. Margaret is currently married for the third time, but what makes this union really exciting is that she was involved with her first two spouses. It's amazing that she avoided legal ramifications after having romantic relationships with not one but two kingpins, engaging in high-level drug dealing and strategically removing herself from them when they faced legal action. The revelation has sparked conversations about Marjorie's unconventional past and how it might have affected her daughter, Lori. The widely held belief that Lori has inherited Marjorie's astute interpersonal and survival abilities, the public's obsession with the family drama, is further heightened by Marjorie's continual disdain for each of Lore's former partners. Complications caused by reports that Marjorie holds the opinion that Lore's current romance was motivated by the need for clout, as her partner's public relations reputation is said to have improved significantly during their relationship this messy story, along with Marjorie's involvement, and Commentary adds to the needless drama and ongoing speculation surrounding the Harvey family. Ask yourself, no, you're going to show us everything, and God's watch me, Ioni. God, watch me, I said. The internet, on the other hand, has a lot to say about this. Some people have even written about it. Marjorie Harvey is surprised that Damon's contract was extended this far. Lori has been an actor's and musician's girlfriend in WG. The next logical step is for her to become a Silicon Valley star. No wonder Lori Harvey, the daughter of Marjorie Harvey, hops from men to men she learned it from her mother. Lori Harvey isn't Steve Harvey's biological daughter, rather. She is Marjorie Harvey's daughter. Valley billionaire's wife or the likes of Sophia Ritchie and marry a rich Nepo baby, the apple doesn't fall far from the tree. Her mother, Marjorie, captures stray dogs, not chow. What do you think about Marjorie's direct meddling in Lore's private matters? Do you think she's defending her kid in a protective motherly manner, or do you think she's going too far and should keep her distance? The continuous tale of Margaret's impact on Lore's partnerships has generated a lot of conversation. Some contend that a mother's impulse for protection is normal and justified. Some argue that there's a thin line separating encouragement from meddling. Should Marjorie keep talking about Lore's sexual pursuits? Or is it time to pull back and allow her daughter to find her own way? Give your thoughts. Subscribe Relax Brew for more videos.